Hey, what up, ladies and gentlemen? This is Be Sanity from the Cisco channel. We're back with another uh, NFT related video. What I'm getting recently. Um, be very transparent with you guys. What I'm buying. What happened recently? Today, I want to talk about this one Genesis, the Girls of Armament. This project, I FOMO'd into it about almost two weeks ago uh, almost three weeks ago right here i'll show you guys the what happened so 18 days ago i bought this uh, 19 days ago i bought this for full mode into it uh my friend told me to buy it i bought it at 0 0.469 ethereum i flipped it next day immediately for 0.76 so i made about right here um 0.2 Ethereum. 0.2 Ethereum. Ask minus all the fees, etc. Uh, sorry, right here. This one right here. This row right here. 0 0.2. 0 0.2064 Ethereum. All right, I was like, okay, pretty good, pretty good uh, profit for like just FOMOing into a NFT that I didn't really know much about. I know it's very cool um, animation. Uh, the style is very nice, but to be honest, I really didn't do research on it. I didn't even join their Discord. My friend was like, just get this, this is cool. And I got it, and then it, it pumped. It went to like 0 0.7 something. So I was like, hey, I'm, I'm not going to be greedy, let's take some profit. And it was pre-reveal, okay? It wasn't revealed yet at that time. There was 10,000 of these, and as you can see, it, and then like, Last week it revealed, and then I, ch I I I always do this. I went back and checked. I was like, "Oh my god, this was the one that I sold." Yeah, rank three hundred and seventy-four, very high ranking. I was like, "Oh shit, why did I sell it?" Yeah, this is what happens. Yeah, I sold it to the guy. This guy Devly. He or she sold it two days ago for point nine. Ethereum. I missed out on uh, much bigger profits, but I think this person sold it for a bit too low. I think this could have sold for at least one point something because from look at this from uh, NFT nerds. Um, I guess last week he could have sold it for like one point something. Because look at this. Um, for example, this this much lower ranking one sold for 1.32 Ethereum. Okay, this is just a reference. This one lower ranking sold for 1.3, 440 rank. I think I think this person could have sold it for a lot more. And if I kept it, I would have probably sold it for at least 1.2, 1.3 Ethereum, according to uh, the history, the price history. Someone bought the number one ranking. Look at this one. For uh, how much? Pretty crazy. For 57 Ethereum. <laughs> I was like, holy shit. 57 Ethereum for this one. This, was, this is the number one ranking. Like the true Genesis. This one looks pretty cool, right? Some naked... Uh, Android robotic girl. Now, this is the original. Now they're listing it for 80, 80 Ethereum. See? It went through two. Wow, okay. First sold for 0.66, then sold for 25, then sold for 57. Now listed for 80. Wow, this, this, is, this one's crazy. Number one ranking. Yeah, I was like, oh man, when I found out mine was high ranking, this is the second time I got a very high ranking um, uh, after, like, the Black Genesis, I got a very high ranking number 14, I sold that for 1.7 Ethereum, but I didn't think I would be lucky, this lucky again. So this is how it is, I can't, can't look back, um, it's, it's, it, this NFT scene is a huge casino, huge uh, lottery. If you get lucky, 
you can, yeah, buy something within the collection. That's very rare. But how often does that happen? Who knows? Yeah, look at this one. The my the black Genesis I sold for one point seven five four. So it is what it is. I made profit, but I could have made more. But can't look back. Anyways, yeah. So recently I did I did more flips. I sold the uh, Boki. This one right here, Boki. Sold for point four. Ended up getting point one nine four eight. And then verbs. I also sold recently. Made small profit, 0 0.037. And then rare land NFT, I also sold for a pretty good price, 0.1. I could have sold for more. I could have sold for like 0.15, but I kind of paper hand. Yeah, these ones right here, I've sold. Made some profits. So in total right now, I'm, I'm, I made about three Ethereum so far. But of course, this does not in take account into account of the garbage that I have right now that I didn't sell. So, for example, I bought some. Yeah, I bought this. Well, I can't say they're garbage, but the price went down. Like Coomers, I bought at like 0 0.05. Now the floor is 0 0.01. But I did get a rare one. Uh, OK Dub Yard Club. This one, if I look, if I sell now, I lose a lot of money. I bought at 0 0.144. So I'm not doing very well, to be honest. I bought a lot of stuff that, with the profits I made for before, I bought a lot of stuff that went down. So I can't really sell, like, official curiosities. Rare, this rare land NFT, I'm okay, I'm up. Cause I only bought, I only paid 0 0.015. And now the floor is 0 0.078. I could have sold it for more if I sold it all. And yeah, there's some of these other garbage. But those were low investments. Yeah, Ivy Boys, I FOMO. I paid 0.35 because they had a drop. They dropped this trunk thing. But the trunk combined with the Ivy Boy, if I sell them now, I'm still losing money. So I'm gonna have to hodl these, hope they go back up in prices, yeah. This OK Asuki is totally rock pole. It's totally dead. I, in total, I spent like 0.2 something on these three OK Asukis. Yeah. This is a lost cost. OK Bears Yacht Club. I also spent a lot, but price is not doing very well. So a lot of these, uh, this Ivy Girls total rock pole is dead. OK baby, ba baby OK bears also dead. Moon boys, not quite dead. I spent 0 0.04, but it's floor price is 0 0.029, so we'll see how that goes. And then sunks, I also did not do well. I spent a lot, 0 0.14, and then floor price is 0 0.055. So I don't know if I should sell these at a loss and buy something else. Who knows? I don't know. Right now. I'm just gonna watch. This Jadu hoverboard is doing okay. I bought at 0 0.06. I bought at 0 0.605 now at 0.675. So imaginary ones doing very very poorly. I bought at very high price, 0.9 something, and now it dropped more than half. I don't know what's going on. Imaginary ones, super hype project, but doing very poorly they have in terms of floor price unemployables also doing very poorly I bought a rare one at 0.45 this was like a few weeks ago so yeah the stuff I sold I'm making money but the stuff I'm holding are not making money so I cannot sell them so I have to hold and wait see what happens and the market is not doing good Except for like crazy stuff like Goblin Town, this which is crazy. Goblin Town is like the top of the town right now in terms of um, price. It's crazy. Look at the price history. Went all the way to like 
12 Ethereum at one point. It's crazy. Hold on, it's not loading. Yeah, look, 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 look at the trend. It's just crazy, dude. Crazy trends. Crazy what? Look at this. 12, almost 12 Ethereum. And then it went down. This was just today. Went down to 7.99, now back to 9.99. Crazy. Goblin Town. I missed out. Totally missed out on that. This is like a free mint too, right? Crazy, dude. Yeah, a lot of degen stuff. A lot of um, clone derives. Now, now it's at 8.15 on OpenSea. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Uh, yeah, a lot of these copycats, goblins, zombies, elves, uh, whatever, what the fuck. It's crazy. It, it, it's a crazy world right now in the NFT space. A lot of uh, elf towns doing good. All these copycats. I've got this one, Apes NFT, in my... Uh, this one's doing okay. It's like AI stuff. AI Apes. Wreck Bird's doing good. I have some, too. Hype Beast. This is doing poorly. The Karafuru. After a review. Yeah. Not the best time for NFTs right now. It's it's a bear market. But there are stuff that you can make money on. In the bear market. But you just have to look very carefully. Be very careful. Don't risk. Don't bet on high risk stuff. Well. Bet on high risk stuff that are low value I guess. That you are able to lose the money. Yeah, because a lot of this stuff I got in at very low price. Like, for example, um, Red Guy, I got in at like uh, 0.3 something, but now it dropped a lot as well. Yeah, Red Birds, I got in at very low, like 0 0.00 something. Anyways, I digress. So, this is what's going on in the NFT bear market. There are hidden gems. Just be very careful. Use tools. There are a lot of free tools. NFT nerds, Trace Sniper, IC tools. I have some paid tools I will talk about in the next video. So please check out my affiliate links down there. You can follow my account uh, on OpenSea. Follow me on uh, on this on uh, Twitter, IG. Join my Discord, we can talk real time regarding NFTs. And I can tell you what I'm buying. I'm very transparent with everything. Yeah, I, I'm not hiding stuff that I'm losing money on. I'm sharing everything. Yeah, so, yeah, check out my channel. I want to grow this channel. So, join me on my journey and subscribe, share with your friends. Give this video a thumbs up. I'm going to say one more time, join my Discord. All right? And I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.